Josh, what an absolutely well, massive play to start the game. Is he going to get the one shot? He gets the one hit KO! Hey everybody, welcome back to Fight for First. Our Cresselia debut uh, ended in flames, so we're gonna give it another shot. I'm gonna I'm gonna try to turn Cresselia into a monster this game. Um, uh, yeah, it's just just not good. Just not good. Not good. Not good at all. But I think this time will be better. We're still in the 1700s, so that's good. Yay. Um, 1726. Okay, buddy. What do we have? Uh, I almost put Sunny Day on this Cresselia. Shoot. Um, Polly, Ludi, great combo. Big fan, big fan. Guardy, that's gonna be the Mega. Heat. Which he'll probably, he'll bring if he doesn't bring the Rain. Amoongus. Lando. And that's it. Okay, so what are we thinking here? I really wanna, wanna bring Cresselia again because it didn't do anything last time. Um, but that being said, how sketch is that? I'm almost feeling a thunderous Amoongus lead. Thunderous Amoongus, Kangaskhan, Cresselia. There's just no reason to bring Cresselia, guys. I just can't for... Conkleder's so much better. As long as I get rid of the Gardevoir, Conkleder's amazing. You know what? F you, Cresselia. You can debut some other time. We're doing this. And I really hope... No, if he leads the Gardevoir, uh, I, I sleep it, I paralyze the teammate, I send out Kangaskhan when my Thunderous dies, and we KO it, and then we let Conkleder finish this game. That's the game plan. So if he leads the Gardevoir, he's going to take something with the intent that we're going to get rid of the Gardevoir later, and it should work out. Although last time I said it should work out, and it did not work out. So... Maybe I don't know what I'm talking about. We're gonna find out. Uh, Polly Ludi Guardi. I'm, I'm thinking he leads. He's not gonna do the rain mode. Is he gonna do the rain mode? There's no way you're gonna do rain mode. Yeah, okay. Guardi Lando. Um, got regenerate. Ew, what? Well, it's gonna make. It's gonna make it get rid of that. That's that's that'll be okay. Um, yeah, can't switch in. And I really want to put the Gardevoir to sleep. I have a Citrus Berry. Can I survive on attack? Yeah, I should. I'm calm. I should. Uh, if I didn't think Amoongus would survive or I wanted to protect Amoongus, I'd Thunder Wave the Gardevoir. But I don't think it's worth it. I'm going to Hidden Power. The Lando. We're going to Spore. Because I'm... I'm <laughs> like, I know it's going to do big damage. But is it going to do enough damage to drop Amoongus? Is it? Is it really... I can't risk him just getting off. Well, I could protect Amoongus. No, let's go for it. I think he's gonna rock slide. Let's make a big surprise. And I think we, I think he could take it. I think he could take it. Um, 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 um. Crossing my fingers. There's the rock slide. Okay, I'm pretty sure we could take a psychic rock slide. Nice, we got that off too. So this is great. Great, I was already planning a worst case scenario. We flinched, but we don't. So that goes down. So that's awesome. Yes. And then if, uh, show me you hyper voice. That would be amazing. Okay, he went for the psychic, which was our still our game plan. We'll see if my calculation, my mental calculation is completely wrong and I suck. Okay, so could have protected Amoongus there and it would have been awesome, but it did not. He's got no more intimidate. So let's send in the con. Send in the con. Now he sends an Amoongus and we're done. Okay, never mind. We're gonna have to. If he's mental herb, it's over. If it's not mental herb, we have a chance. Taunting the Amoongus, Mega Protect. It's our only move here because otherwise he just Rage Powder does his thing. And we can't deal with that. This is our, already our big weakness here. Um, can't believe that dropped my Amoongus. It's calm and everything. That's Struggle Bus. Good switch on his part. He probably did not bring the rain at all. So he's probably got Heatran in the back. But Congler can take out everything as long as we get rid of Gardevoir. So. Do something stupid here, opponent. Protect Gardevoir. Spore Kangaskhan. That'd be awesome. Uh, actually, do that. Please do that. Don't be Mental Herb. Protect. Protect your Gardevoir. Protect. 
Protect. Absolutely amazing. Absolutely just the best. Please don't be mental herb. Don't be mental herb. What is with all these Japanese sludge bomb moongus? What the heck? Okay, well this is sketch. Yo, so we basically rely on my return KOing this Gardevoir. And uh, I guess we just gotta be happy with that. Um, I'm gonna go for a big ice punch on the Amoongus. May switch out the Gardevoir, put me to sleep. That'd be pretty sketch. I think if I were him, that's what I would do, but I can't risk it right now. I can't risk it. Okay. Please KO this Gardevoir. Yes, it was the Heatran. We win if this Gardevoir goes down. Show me big damage. That's not going down. I should have mock punched it. Oh, I feel so dumb. Conkledur being the big man on campus. Taking that like a champ. Freeze. <laughs> Chucks. Um... Does he leave it in? Does he protect? Okay, I'm gonna get risky right now because I really don't think he's just gonna let the Gardevoir go down. I'm playing risky. Mock Punch, Power Punch, the Heatran. Playing so risky, but I have to. I pretty much have to. I really hope he doesn't just make a really, doesn't play really obvious. Don't protect Heatran. Don't protect Heatran. Don't protect Heatran. Oh no, that was our hope. That was our hope. That was a nice hope too. Oh yeah, that's over. Um, He got us. He got us. Oh man, the fact that Arcanescon doesn't KO Mega Gardevoir is a pain in the neck. I mean, I expect a Rage Powder here. If I were him, I'd Rage Powder. Okay. Um, mit whiff on the Conkledur. How does that sound? Whiff on the Conkledur. Whiff on the Conkledur. Whiff. Whiff. Whiffed. Damn it. All right. Yep. That's going to sink. That's going to sink us. Okay. Well, shucks. That's not good. We hinged on it KOing the God of War. It did not kill the Gardevoir. This is frustrating. But, I mean, there's nothing. I'm just going to sit here and die now. Kill me. Kill me. Yeah. Uh, well, I hinged on also the Amoongus surviving. So I guess I completely underestimated Mega Gardevoir. At least whatever set they're running. Uh, the fact that he had Sludge Bomb also threw off the fact that he was able to KO the Thunderous that turn without attacking. Or with, you know, without attacking with Gardevoir. So, nice, nice little pocket text there. Nice little pocket text. Now I'm a little salty because we're back under 1700, but you live and you learn. So, that's going to end this week. I guess it's not going to end spectacularly, but come Monday, it's going to be awesome. Trust me, it's going to be awesome. Anyway, guys, thanks so much for being here. We're going to figure out how to keep climbing. Um... Yeah, yeah, I still, hmm. No, I don't, I mean, I don't think it was that bad. I still think we had a hope. I still think we had a hope. So I can't edit anything until, like, I completely get demolished, you know? Because then I'll know something that's actually wrong. But if we just played that differently, I think we could have won. So don't ever fall into the trap where your team loses and there's something wrong with your team. That was just wrong with me. I just played that incorrectly. But now I know Gardevoir is a threat. I wrote it down. Anyway, guys, see you guys Monday on Five for First, and I hope you guys enjoy. I have a special upload coming up this weekend, my collab with Aaron Cybertron Zhang. You should watch it. It's good. It'll be here Sunday, probably Sunday. Sunday? Saturday? Sunday? Watch it. It's going to be hype. Yeah. So see you Monday, and that's all.